Um, we've been here since 2004. Okay. Yep. All right. So you're getting things the way you want them. And Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. We had to take down a lot of wallpaper and paint some walls. So and changing light fixtures. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, we're getting them to work finally after <laughs> for a year. We hadn't done anything with it. Yeah. Oh, hey. No. Trust me. I know my house is still under construction, and we've been living there for three years. So. Yeah. Yeah. There's always like <laughs> something to be done. Yeah. There's always. It's I mean, not like getting around to doing okay. it. Yeah. It looks beautiful. Thank you. You said you had like a transitional. Yeah. That's kind know, of like how style. I would describe it. Kind of like some Definitely. traditional, some other, you know. Yeah. More modern, maybe elements. I love it, and I love the color in the in the dining room. Actually, yeah, I used to have a red dining room myself, and yeah, it's very stimulating. Yes, you know? it was it's hard to decide on the color, room. but eventually we did. Yeah, yeah. it's great. It's yeah. great. I actually, um, you know, typically prefer red in the dining room. I used to just design every room in the house, oh, okay. not just nurseries, but I always preferred red. And my painter would always, you know, I, my clients would call my painter, and he'd be like, "Oh, Sherry was here, and it's another red dining room." But <laughs> you know, it's great for dining rooms and kitchens because it stimulates conversation, it stimulates appetite. You know, yes. it's perfect. Yeah, I know. something you know, always for a bedroom when you want to sleep. But here, you want liveliness. You yes, know? yes, yes. So it's perfect. Yeah, I'm glad you like it. Yeah, I love it. It's perfect. Look at this. I love all the little dormers and the little nooks and crannies. Yeah, this is the perfect room for it. Oh my gosh, it is so nice. And I guess the, the big thing we need to de decide mm -hmm. before I start, you know, thinking about furniture and everything you would want in here is the purposes of this room. You know, it looks like the guest room now. Yes. Okay. Will it continue to be a guest room when the baby comes? Like, it, you know, some people, they, they want a little day bed or something in here so that when guests come, they can still use it. They just put the baby into a little portable. I have another bedroom downstairs that, that is actually the guest room. This is like okay. the second guest room. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> yeah. Maybe two guests once you yeah. got a baby, right? Yeah. <laughs> and the closet was... What are we doing with the closet? Are you going to be able to use this for baby or? Yes, everything's going to be for the baby. You mind if I take a peek? Okay. It, it is, you know, <laughs> that's trust me. I've got scary clothes too. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Just so we can kind of see what we're looking yeah. for as far as storage for the baby. Yeah. Oh, look at your shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I know I've got shoes everywhere. They are fun. I love those. <laughs> I might have to borrow them. Um, okay, so we've got hanging space for the baby, which mm -hmm. is great. And you know, maybe what <laughs> what we we'll want to do is do like little. Little rolling cart type little drawer things if you need for little baby gadgets, you know, yeah. things like that, or some toy storage. But if we can use this for the baby, that's great. All your hanging clothes can go there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's adorable <laughs> wallpaper for a girl, yeah. you know, but I think maybe if, if you're not opposed to it, it might be a great time to take it out because, in all honesty, eventually your child's going to want it out. Probably. You know, your, your little girl gets to be seven, eight years old, she's going to say, Mom, I want orange walls, or, you know, you never know, but it's very likely she's going to outgrow this anyway. So okay. it might be the time to do it now. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Okay. I would love to do, like, pink or something like that, but, you yeah. know, if it's a girl. Yeah. You know, but then at the end, I'm, like, torn, like, if I should, if that's a smart, like, idea, practical, you know, that a, you know. I, it, you know, if the, if the girl is going to stay here in this room, why not? And, mm -hmm. but it, even if, a couple years down the road, paint is inexpensive. You know, yeah. if you want to change it, if you want to make this a little boys' room down the road, you know, it's not going to be near the pain of taking down the wallpaper. Mm -hmm. You know, a couple of cans of paint a day or two with a painter in here, and you've got blue walls or whatever color you want. So I wouldn't hesitate to personalize the walls. You know, mm -hmm. what you'd want to avoid is the really expensive murals.